What is up, people? Today we are going to be checking out the Weber Jumbo Joe 18-inch charcoal grill. The grill does come with some literature. So we have the assembly guide. It was really, really easy to put together. Uh, we have like a Weber's grill app, situational information sheet with the grill. You're, you're going to want to fire it up and get it nice and hot. Burn off all of this chemically factory residue type situations. You don't want that for cooking. So you got to do a nice hot fire before you actually use it. Situations. Yeah, let's check it out. All right, so five burgers right there. Five brats. Plenty of surface area left over. I mean, look for yourself here, peeps. Looking pretty good. So we do have a little airflow coming up from the bottom. We've got some airflow coming up from the top. We're gonna actually open that up a little bit more. Ooh, that's hot. That's a hot puppy. Woo-wee! Don't be stupid and touch me. Ha <laughs> ha, hot metal on a grill. Spicy hot. Now, let's take that opportunity to address that. Weber's done a really good job with these little heat shields covering the uh, handle so you don't get spicy hot like you did right there. Artistic pan coming at you. That's what happens here on this channel. Artisticness. All the time. Anyway, uh, back to the Weber. So, another cool thing about it, but here's another purpose for this kind of wire contraption here. Yeah. Lid holder. What's up? What is up? That's right. You see that? It's off kilter. It doesn't matter because it's on there. See, we can go over this way too. Look at that. Yeah. That's right, they hit you different angles. Weber? Okay, I gotta tell you, trying to scoop up some meat here to flip it. There's a lip there on the side, and I'm loving that. Nice and handy for flipping some meat. It's a grilling airplane you're hearing. It's getting closer. Let's take a look, shall we? Weber, it's holding the temperature really well. I gotta be honest with you. Like we didn't put a lot of coals in here. I don't know if you can see down here. We have like 24 coals in here. It's one short of 25, that's how I remember. We have 24 in here in this big little grill. Big because of the surface area. Little obviously because of its squat nature and size. The Weber, it's, it's held its heat really well with these 24 coals. The lid cover system here, where you don't have to put it on the ground or hold it. Pretty happy with it. Make sure to check down below for the link, the description and the price. If you're interested in checking out this Weber grill for yourself. All right, underneath we've got the ash pan, which is nice and removable. Sits up there uh, fairly comfortable. Kind of had it loose already, but sits so up there pretty well uh, and then we do have our controls underneath to kind of go ahead and open up a little bit of bottom damper uh, very similar to the top here and then this is what we're looking like all closed up with the wire which makes it nice and easy to carry this puppy it's a nice portable grill perfect road tripper or camper many thanks Got some blackberries right there. It's almost time for some harvesting. Got quite a few of them, really. People, if you're new in town, please consider subscribing. We'd appreciate it. Thank you for watching, though, with all that being said. Have a great rest of your day. Keep your nose clean, peeps. Bye-bye.